Welcome back. Welcome back. Your man, Dominic K. In here, of course, the Dominic K. Show on fire-tv.com is where you go to uh, check out the program. I am here weekdays, 6 p.m. Anywhere you get your podcast, just search the Diamond K Show. So, former Baltimore City State's Attorney, uh, Marilyn Mosby, and City Council President Nick Mosby uh, are getting a divorce. They're getting a divorce. Uh, and, um, you know, I just, I, I hate to see it. I, I, I hate to see it. Uh, they've been married for 17 years. And um, today it's it's coming out that it is coming to an end. This power couple who's been a fixture in Baltimore politics for over 10 years. They've often appeared together. Through the ups, through the downs. Uh, But they told the Baltimore Banner in a joint statement that after careful consideration and much prayer, we have decided to end our marriage. They continued, we want to emphasize our commitment as strong co-parents moving forward, as well as our dedication to our family and community remains unwavering. Now they added that they're not going to talk about this anymore. They're not going to do any interviews regarding the divorce proceedings. They've asked for privacy. Let's keep in mind that they have two kids, two daughters, uh, a 12 year old and a 14 year old. Uh, The filing, which was first reported by the Baltimore brew, um, and, uh, and now if we, if we break this down, Marilyn Mosby, 43 years old, she has continued to make headlines even after losing the 2022 uh, Democratic primary to Ivan Bates. She left office earlier this year. Now there's a pending trial on some bogus federal uh, perjury and, and mortgage fraud charges. Prosecutors claim that she lied about a financial hardship in order to access retirement funds without financial penalty uh, under a a federal coronavirus relief law that was temporarily relaxed uh, during the pandemic and then lied on a mortgage application tied to the purchase of two Florida properties. Let's keep in mind, people, what Congress has done. I I mean, she did have a a hardship during uh, COVID-19, the pandemic. She had a travel business. So uh, she's maintained her innocence. Her defense has complained that she's being selectively prosecuted due to her race and, uh, and her politics. Now, on the other side of this, you have Nick Mosby. He's 44. He's served as the city council president since 2020. Previously represented Maryland's 40th district in the state house of delegates and Baltimore's seventh district in the city council. So records show that the former prosecutor filed for a limited divorce. Now, under Maryland law, a limited divorce does not actually end the marriage. But here's what it does. It provides a mechanism for the spouses to go before court and address issues such as finances and child custody. Now, an absolute divorce legally ends a marriage. So the court filing uh, says that they want uh, joint physical and legal custody of the children. And also the court to order the council president to continue to provide health insurance for the family, contribute to school and transportation costs, and cover any uh, medical expenses. Now, the petition also asked to shield the divorce hearing from the public. So uh, all of this according to the Baltimore Banner so I mean I, I I hate to see you know a couple like this uh, definitely a power couple uh, and uh, I've seen them out many times 
Uh, all of my media interactions with them have been positive. Uh, both folks are champions for justice. And uh, but there's a lot of pressure. There's a lot of pressure in politics. There's a lot of pressure for a public couple. And I don't know uh, whether or not uh, the pressure, the enemies of, of Marilyn Mosby, uh, of all you know, all of those things uh, can weigh on a relationship, can weigh on things. Um, so I, I'm definitely uh, hoping for the best for this family. Uh, this is a, a tricky time. And uh, like I said, it's it's you know it, it, it's sad when any union ends. Uh, it seems like they're on decent terms, uh, so that is is good. Okay, let me know your thoughts in the comment section: Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, LinkedIn, TikTok at the Diamond K Show. Of course, uh, on Fire Dash TV is where you go. Uh, the Diamond K Show. You can check us out weekdays, six p.m. Anywhere you get your podcast, just search. The Diamond K Show. I will see you guys on Monday.